Fermentation is a metabolic process that converts sugar to acids, gases and or alcohol. It occurs in yeast and bacteria, but also in oxygen-starved muscle cells, as in the case of lactic acid fermentation. Fermentation is also used more broadly to refer to the bulk growth of microorganisms on a growth medium. French microbiologist Louis Pasteur is often remembered for his insights into fermentation and its microbial causes. The science of fermentation is known as zymology. Fermentation takes place in the absence of oxygen and becomes the seller Euro unregistered trademark as primary means of ATP production. It turns NADH and pyruvate produced in the glycolysis step into NAD plus and various small molecules. In the presence of O2, NADH and pyruvate are used in respiration. This is oxidative phosphorylation, it generates a lot more ATP in addition to that created by glycolysis, and for that reason cells generally benefit from avoiding fermentation when oxygen is available. Exceptions include obligate anaerobes, which cannot tolerate oxygen. The first step, glycolysis, is common to all fermentation pathways. C6H12O6 plus 2 Namibian dollars plus plus 2 ADP plus 2 Pia 2 CH3 Kakua plus 2 NADH plus 2 ATP plus 2 hours duo plus 2 hours plus. Pyruvate is CH3 Kakua. Pi is phosphate. 2 ADP molecules and 2 Pi are converted to 2 ATP in 2 water molecules via substrate level phosphorylation. 2 molecules of NAD plus are also reduced to NADH. In oxidative phosphorylation the energy for ATP formation is derived from an electrochemical proton gradient generated across the inner mitochondrial membrane via the electron transport chain. Glycolysis has substrate level phosphorylation. Fermentation has been used by humans for the production of food and beverages since the Neolithic age. For example, Fermentation is employed for preservation in a process that produces lactic acid as found in such sour foods as pickled cucumbers, kimchi and yogurt, as well as for producing alcoholic beverages such as wine and beer. Fermentation can even occur within the stomachs of animals, such as humans. Autobrewery syndrome is a rare medical condition where the stomach contains brewer's yeast that break down starches into ethanol, which enters the bloodstream. Examples. Fermentation does not necessarily have to be carried out in an anaerobic environment. For example, even in the presence of abundant oxygen, yeast cells greatly prefer fermentation to aerobic respiration, as long as sugars are readily available for consumption. The antibiotic activity of hops also inhibits aerobic metabolism in yeast. Fermentation reacts NADH with an endogenous, organic electron acceptor. Usually this is pyruvate formed from the sugar during the glycolysis step. During fermentation, pyruvate is metabolized to various compounds through several processes. Ethanol fermentation, also known as alcoholic fermentation, is the production of ethanol and carbon dioxide. Lactic acid fermentation refers to two means of producing lactic acid. Homolactic fermentation is the production of lactic acid exclusively. Heterolactic fermentation is the production of lactic acid as well as other acids and alcohols. Sugars are the most common substrate of fermentation, and typical examples of fermentation products are ethanol, lactic acid, carbon dioxide, and hydrogen gas. However, more exotic compounds can be produced by fermentation, such as butyric acid and acetone. Yeast carries out fermentation in the production of ethanol in beers, wines, and other alcoholic drinks, along with the production of large quantities of carbon dioxide. Fermentation occurs in mammalian muscle during periods of intense exercise where oxygen supply becomes limited, resulting in the creation of lactic acid. Chemistry Fermentation products contain chemical energy, but are considered waste products, since they cannot be metabolized further without the use of oxygen. Ethanol fermentation the chemical equation below shows the alcoholic fermentation of glucose, whose chemical formula is C6H12O6. One glucose molecule is converted into two ethanol molecules and two carbon dioxide molecules. C6H12O6O2C2H5OH plus 2CO2. 
C2H5OH is the chemical formula for ethanol. Before fermentation takes place, one glucose molecule is broken down into two pyruvate molecules. This is known as glycolysis. Lactic acid fermentation. Homolactic fermentation is the simplest type of fermentation. The pyruvate from glycolysis undergoes a simple redox reaction, forming lactic acid. It is unique because it is one of the only respiration processes to not produce a gas as a byproduct. Overall, one molecule of glucose is converted to two molecules of lactic acid, C6H12O6O2CH3CHACU. It occurs in the muscles of animals when they need energy faster than the blood can supply oxygen. It also occurs in some kinds of bacteria and some fungi. It is this type of bacteria that converts lactose into lactic acid in yogurt, giving it its sour taste. These lactic acid bacteria can carry out either homolactic fermentation, where the end product is mostly lactic acid, or heterolactic fermentation, where some lactate is further metabolized and results in ethanol and carbon dioxide, acetate, or other metabolic products. For example, C6H12O6 or CH3 Chaku plus C2H5OH plus CO2. If lactose is fermented, it is first converted into glucose and galactose. C12H22O11 plus H2OA2 C6H12O6. Heterolactic fermentation is in a sense intermediate between lactic acid fermentation and other types, for example, alcoholic fermentation. The reasons to go further and convert lactic acid into anything else are, the acidity of lactic acid impedes biological processes. This can be beneficial to the fermenting organism as it drives out competitors who are unadapted to the acidity. As a result the food will have a longer shelf life. However, beyond a certain point, the acidity starts affecting the organism that produces it. The high concentration of lactic acid drives the equilibrium backwards, decreasing the rate at which fermentation can occur, and slowing down growth. Ethanol, that lactic acid can be easily converted to, is volatile and will readily escape, allowing the reaction to proceed easily. CO2 is also produced, however it's only weakly acidic, and even more volatile than ethanol. Acetic acid is acidic, and not as volatile as ethanol. However, in the presence of limited oxygen, its creation from lactic acid releases a lot of additional energy. It is a lighter molecule than lactic acid, that forms fewer hydrogen bonds with its surroundings, and thus more volatile and will also allow the reaction to move forward more quickly. If propionic acid, butyric acid and longer monocarboxylic acids are produced, the amount of acidity produced per glucose consumed will decrease, as with ethanol allowing faster growth. Aerobic respiration, in aerobic respiration, the pyruvate produced by glycolysis is oxidized completely, generating additional ATP and NADH in the citric acid cycle and by oxidative phosphorylation. However, this can occur only in the presence of oxygen. Oxygen is toxic to organisms that are obligate anaerobes, and is not required by facultative anaerobic organisms. In the absence of oxygen, one of the fermentation pathways occurs in order to regenerate NAD+. Lactic acid fermentation is one of these pathways. Hydrogen gas production in fermentation, hydrogen gas is produced in many types of fermentation, as a way to regenerate NAD+, from NADH. Electrons are transferred to ferredoxin, which in turn is oxidized by hydrogenase, producing H2. Hydrogen gas is a substrate for methangens and sulfate reducers, which keep the concentration of hydrogen low and favor the production of such an energy-rich compound, but hydrogen gas at a fairly high concentration can nevertheless be formed, as in flatus. As an example of mixed acid fermentation, bacteria such as Clostridium pastorianum ferment glucose producing butyrate, acetate, carbon dioxide and hydrogen gas. The reaction leading to acetate is, C6H12O6 plus 4 hours duo a 2 ch 3 coo plus 2HCO3 plus 4 hours plus plus 4 hours 2, glucose could theoretically be converted into just CO2 and H2, but the global reaction releases little energy. Methane gas production in fermentation, 
acetic acid can also undergo a dismutation reaction to produce methane and carbon dioxide, CH3 Cua Euro plus H plus a CH4 plus CO2 AAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAA